I doubt it if it's healthy. I don't really think so, but I'm digging it. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to a new video. I am on the airport. Well, I'm just gonna walk away a little bit. I'm in Los Angeles on the airport and I'm heading to Florida. I'm flying to Tampa. I have no idea where that actually is. I do know it is not Miami. And I will be working here for two days. I will be shooting. I'm gonna take you guys with and show you what a work trip is really like. I heard that Madison Hedrick is there as well. Uh, and I know her, so that will be like a lot of fun. I'm like every time cutting it really, really close because it is 9.35 and my flight is at 10. So let's see, we're ready to go. I was craving like a matcha a lot and I never got in a matcha at Starbucks but it's so 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 sweet I added coconut milk and it is almost undrinkable I couldn't I would not recommend it well I am about to win. actually really nice because I had internet in the plane I often I don't like to put the uh, Wi-Fi on because I kind of feel it's like a moment where nobody disturbs me but now actually it was good because I worked a lot um, so I'm gonna grab an uber right now it's another one and a half hour drive I did not know that <laughs> so yeah we'll arrive very late today so guys we arrived in my hotel room i was editing a little bit and i am oh my god did i forget my toothbrush oh my god no it's here yay you guys don't understand how much i love my toothbrush because it has this like super fancy kit and ta -da! there you go i took a really nice shower when i came back and i also realized that i forgot to take my um shampoo because Always when I travel, I bring my own shampoo and stuff because very often in the hotels It's just really not good as you can see. It looks like kind of dry and it's not that dry but Bad shampoo. Okay, I'm gonna brush my teeth quickly and I'm gonna go to bed Am I by the way the only one who like brushes their teeth with like warm water? I was literally just thinking about it. I think it just <laughs> Because a friend of mine was like, why are you doing that? And I was like, well, you clean with warm water. So I feel you should also brush your teeth with warm water. So I'm shooting for the catalog tomorrow. And uh, I know the team I shot with them before like a couple weeks ago in Miami. And everyone's super nice. So I think it's going to be like a lot of fun. And I saw yesterday, they were kind of in this like village or play set. Which really looked like Mykonos and like Santorini, like Greece. And I was like, oh that's interesting <laughs> so i'm very curious to see what the location shoot is going to be so my call time is going to be uh 7:15 in the lobby so i think it's so early what time is it 10:45. that's pretty good it's <laughs> in LA, it's like 7:15. but tip number one for jet lag and especially if you're working never really think about like the time where you work just always immediately adapt which i did i ate like so much food makes me always like super tired I am going to sleep and I'm going to nap. Have a good night. Good morning guys. It is 7 a.m. I'm gonna show you guys my little view. Ta -da. There's like a little harbor here. All like the pools. It is so like gray out. I think today it was gonna be 26 degrees uh, Celsius obviously. I don't know in Fahrenheit with a lot of like thunderstorms. 
And I think tomorrow is going to be 15, which is really, really cold. I am already. I am wearing something really chill. It almost feels like a pajama. This um, is just like a linen shirt. I think I bought this like in Saint Tropez. And then I'm wearing these like linen pants. These are from Max Mara. And then I have these sliders. And my uh, Louis bag. So Florida. It almost feels like I'm on vacation. But I'm not. We're gonna go downstairs, meet the team. Oh, I need water, I'm so thirsty. And my tripod. Oh, so we did a quick little fitting here. These are all the looks, this is today. And here we got all the clothes. Finished. So we just finished our fitting, so I tried on all the looks and they're making some alterations. And now I am going to get my hair and makeup done. I already put my robe on. I think they put like a, because we're on location, they put like a van on the street where we're gonna get ready. It's really cold here. <laughs> Not what I expected from Florida. You can see this like really gray. Hi. Oh, great, here. Yes. Oh, I'm good, how are you? Like, good to see you too. So the hair and makeup is almost ready. Obviously, this is not the final. I'm gonna take this out and then I'll have some wavy hair. And I think I'm still waiting on some mascara. Um, yeah, and then we are going to get changed. And we're gonna start shooting and we really need to like, uh, shoot a little bit in between the rain showers. It's not raining yet, but hopefully this happens. So I'm gonna take you guys outside. Uh, it's a little bit windy, but so we're shooting in this house, which literally looks like and we're shooting there on the harbor and there's another model Nikita and they're all getting ready I really hope that it's not gonna oh shit I should go inside I'm on the shot I really hope it's uh, not gonna rain <laughs> the other model is shooting now they already set up like catering for lunch and we've been shooting so many looks already because it's every time like about the rain so i think the client wants to get it done like as soon as possible because in the afternoon we might not be able to shoot and we might be already on our last like look um i should probably go upstairs and see where we're gonna where we're gonna go Hey guys, introduce yourself. Introduce yourself. Oh wait, sorry. Yeah. What's up guys, I'm Richard Quadi here on set in Sarasota. There we go. We actually met like uh, two years ago in Miami because um, you're a friend of Matt. Yeah. It's such a small world, you know. So it's lunch time and I got grilled salmon, their brown rice and lentils, salad, mm -hmm. and lemonade. Mm -hmm. I'm just walking up four stairs and this is how good my condition is. <laughs> I don't do cardio. <laughs> Let's have a look. Ready? Cardio. So guys, that was a wrap of day one. We were actually really lucky. Right. 
There was maybe two seconds of rain, but it looks like it is going to rain or storm big time tonight or tomorrow. Like the winds are, or the, the trees are going like this. But thankfully we got everything done on time. So uh, yeah, we're gonna head to the hotel. And I think, so stupid, I forgot my workout clothes. I wanna go for a workout, but um, let's see. I don't know yet what I'm going to do. But yeah. So I just came back into my hotel room and I ordered some room service because sometimes uh, when you're on like a trip, there are like team dinners. Um, the team had a team dinner last night and today everyone is just like hanging out in the room and like chilling a little bit. I ordered a Beyond Burger, like the meat burger. I've actually, I've only had like a couple bites from Max, but I've never had that. I never ordered one, so I'm very curious with some sweet potato fries. Um, I always, I think 99% of the time I eat healthy, but sometimes I just really crave also something unhealthy. And it's all about Ben. Here we go. So we got some fries. And we got a burger here. Now who says models don't eat? burger you're supposed to eat with your hands anyway i'm very curious on this beyond meat burger i kind of want to know what are because i know that a lot of you guys are also very like health conscious i think for sure it's better than a regular burger but what do you guys think of this have you tried this or it really does taste like meat though i doubt this if it's healthy i don't really think so but i'm digging it <laughs> So guys, I think this is kind of also a little fun moment to share with you guys because, you know, modeling has such amazing, uh, amazing qualities. Is that a good word? I don't know, like I get to travel the world. I have been to Asia, I have been to South America, every city in Europe, and I discover constantly new places, which is something I really really enjoy um different cultures different languages different cities you really get like a vibe but we also meet so many different people on the on the road and i have friends in almost every continent which is just amazing that over the last only like few years i built such a big group of like friends and community all over but these are also kind of like, there are also like downsides of this, right? Sometimes it can be very exhausting every time when you're working with new people on sets because it kind of, yeah, think about it as your first work day. Uh, you know, you need to get used to the people and you always feel like you have to not like to be on your tippy toes, but a little bit. And yeah, I kind of wanted to share a little bit on inside with you guys as well. and. I also want to show you guys that it's not always as glamorous as it is and I want to show that with this kind of moment with you because social media is not always what it looks like and especially from the fashion industry and even like influencers but models you know we also tend to share to our most beautiful moments and I also do that but I also want to show you guys who my play a little bit like a different side so yeah good morning guys it is 6 38 right now and i'm about to head out today is going to be our second and last shoot day so it is 15 degrees out i don't know how many fahrenheit we're gonna go to the beach and we're gonna shoot some summer clothes it's gonna be free freezing cold i didn't even bring like really warm sweaters i just have this like frame sweater and like a blazer hopefully in the van where we get ready and stuff they always um they have like heaters and stuff but oh it's gonna be a fun day but yeah i'm gonna pack everything and we're gonna head out on our location here's our motorhome of today it's windy it's not that cold i thought it was going to be colder so that's a good thing um i'm gonna get my hair and makeup done and 
hopefully we will be done early today let me show you guys quickly how the RV looks like so here we're gonna get hair makeup done and there is styling and a lot going on so here's gonna be makeup hair styling in here we can hang out with you okay guys we did our first shot on the beach and we got almost blown away by the wind yeah. sun is actually nice and we're gonna go outside for the rest i can't talk outside because you won't hear anything because of me. Yeah. God. It is crazy outside. The wind, you guys, is so extremely strong and you can't hear each other. <laughs> All the clothes are like flying away. Um, so hopefully we have some like good pictures, but um, I think the whole team is gonna come back. We're having like a little coffee break. I'm freezing, but at least we were wearing these like silver blankets which like keep you warm and they have like a heater so they really take like good care of me and where they like you know trying to warm me up in between the shots um we might do some other shots in the afternoon somewhere else so yeah <sighs> good morning guys it is 4 a.m and um I am about to head to the airport again. My flight is at 6.30. Oh my god, it was literally the only flight out. And it's like an hour drive. So yeah, I had a very chilled evening. I was really tired. Also, my skin was super tired, I think, because of the sun and the water here. I just got like redness everywhere. So yeah, I just literally chilled and I did a little like face mask. So yeah, I'm gonna head out. I hope you guys enjoyed watching my little work trip i actually really liked it i vlogged the whole thing and it feels like i'm a little less lonely or something that i'm not alone on the road which is very very nice let me know in the comments down below if you have any questions for me or if you would like to see more of this kind of content and also don't forget to say hi on instagram and i will see you guys very soon